Hello everybody and welcome back to the tutorial. Today we're just going to simply count how many names are in a list and uh, return the number of names. So uh, let's get started shall we? This. Okay so first off we're going to create a names list. Okay and then we're going to populate it with some names. Dave uh, Pete, Paul, and let's say Joe. Okay, so that's our names list. I'm going to create a little function here called <coughs> count names. Okay, count names. And then we're going to say create a variable x is equal to names dot count okay and what we're going to do is we're going to count <coughs> how many names are in here but we're going to count how many duplicate names are in here so if I type in here Dave whoops not like that Dave okay and then I type in uh, let's say Paul okay so we've got duplicates in there so we're going to count the duplicates in here so first of all uh, I want to count a duplicate I will count in fact I'll do one more that Dave okay I want to find out how many duplicates of Dave there are in the list so I'll pass it to the parameter Dave Okay, and now I'm going to print out the information for the user. I'm going to use the format function here because it's uh, it's a lot easier and it makes it uh, well, it's, it's a lot more convenient, I think. Anyway, so there are, and then this is where we're going to put X in here. There are X occurrences. of this name okay so there are x occurrences of this name all I have to do now is call the function by count names count names and then just save it okay and let's uh, run the function shall we so let me just expand this a little bit further. So um, there are three occurrences of this name. So we look for Dave. So we've got Dave 1, Dave 2, and Dave 3. Okay, let's change that. Let's say uh, Joe. Let's see how many occurrences there are of Joe in this. Uh, Joe, yeah, there are one occurrences. <laughs> Sorry about the grammar there, folks. That should have been there is one occurrence. Okay, but you get the gist, don't you? So there's one Joe in there. And uh, let's have a look again. Let's test this out. Let's say Paul. Let's see how many occurrences there are of Paul in here. Okay, two occurrences of Paul. So we've got Paul there and we've got Paul there. So there you go. Bob's your uncle and Fanny is your auntie. Um, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button below. It will really help out the channel. And I will see you in another video. Bye-bye.